I always see that there are five important questions in news ministry. If we want to train anyone in news ministry, I think these, we need to address these five questions. The first one, why do we do youth ministry? What's your goal? Why do you do this? Why do you take your time to use ministry? What's the biblical foundation for this? The second one is for whom? That who are the youth who we engage with? What kind of habits do they have? What do they like? How do they speak? What do they uh, really like? So we need to know them if we want to do good sessions or good Bible studies. The third one is how. That's the question what most of the people ask. That how to lead a session, how to prepare a session, how to counsel them, how to help with the parents, how to handle really tough questions, what they have, how to lead a, a team. So we have so many questions on how. The fourth one is that uh, who is the youth leader? We need to concentrate on the person, the youth leader. How healthy is he? How is his face? How, how can we help him or her? Uh, we should help uh, him or her to not burn out. And the last one is what? The question of what? What do we teach there? What's the, what's the theological, the biblical foundation and the deepness what we teach there? What's the, what's the topics, what is really important and what are answers for there? So the theological background of all of it. So we need to address these five questions that for whom, why do we do this, how do we do this, who is doing this and what do we do in youth ministry. So we need to address these five questions. But also what I see that if we want to train them in a really good way, we need to make networking, networks for them. Networks where they can engage, where they can share their challenges, where they can uh, share their experiences in, in the youth ministry. If we want to train them in a good way, Andrew Root, one of my favorites, says that we need to address the problem. In news ministry, that's our goal, Andrew, Andrew Root says, that address the problem. And which it means is that uh, if, we, if we address the good problems, what's their real situation? What's their real needs? What's their, their real question? If we find that question, we can give good answers for that. So that's our role in, in youth ministry training as well, to address the problem and find the good problem. And after that, we can do a good training for them.